right, all right, all right. Welcome to another one about my stumps. World of Tanks console replays. We're on Abbey. We're in the Lansing Sea. The Lansing Sea. I'm in my Lance. Sir Lancelot, I will call it from now on. I am in Sir Lancelot. This isn't the dragon version. This is the plain Jane version. Um, the dragon version hits a little bit harder. But I almost think I like the fact that the reload on this is shorter. I think. And if I'm not mistaken, the gun's slightly more accurate. Don't quote me on that, though. I don't have the stats up in front of me. But I think the, the dragon version looks better. But I think I kind of like this tank better. Then again, I could be an idiot. I've only played the dragon a couple times. I've only played this a couple times. Well, probably four or five times. Excuse me. I had to burp and hiccup at the same time. And neither one really came out. Lucky for you guys, huh? We're going to take off really quick. Get over to this side, the one-two line. And see if we can get a little bit of damage in. It is a tier 9 battle. Uh, the gun is up to it. The mobility is up to it. This thing is just pretty much though a big piece of plastic glass or something. A big piece of porcelain. Because the minute it gets hit, it... You know, doesn't take anything to go through it. It's pretty, uh, she's definitely not a heavily armored medium, that's for sure. She's more like a heavy, ar heavily armored light. I think that's it's a good way to look at it. It's a heavily armored light tank with a semi-derp gun. Because it's not really a derp, but actually the accuracy isn't horrible. The gun isn't bad. The gun handling stats aren't horrible. M103. We're going to take 353 out of him. But we're not going to stick around to reload. We're going to stick around. We're going to go. go. We we'll try to get one in there because I have a tank in front of me. So hopefully they get hit and not me. <laughs> Using a teammate for the meat shield. But nothing really pops up there. So ooh, 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 ooh. come on, come on. No, not happening. T30 down there. I'd like to be able to hit him. Come on. Can I get one in on him. There he is, fully aimed, and aiming between the turret and the uh, the hull, and somehow I do track damage, because that's... <sighs> but we end up doing 313 in that shot, and then there's the uh, defender coming up, so we're going to, as soon as we're undetected, or I hope I am, zoot scoot boogie behind, beside him, and see if I can get a shot into the, the defender. I don't know what happened there. I think it was lag. Because that fired like a second after he was destroyed. And I know I didn't do that. You does 16. I'm gonna aim right in here. We don't scope, but we aim. It doesn't do anything. Alright, so this time we'll actually aim. See what happens. One down a little bit lower. Down there. And nothing. Just dinged him. So you know what we do next? We do what's called an auto lock. Oh, whoops. No, we didn't do an auto lock this way. We aim right for his gun. That one penetrates. Okay, seems legit. See, there's a bunch of tanks on the AB 98 area, 8987 area. So I'm going to try to zoot scoot back and see if I can help any tanks back towards base. Oop. Object 704. Nope. Now, to be fair, he did turn as I was firing. So, you know, I guess. But you know what does work? Auto lock on the move. 278. And auto lock on the move does 278. Fully aiming? Nope. Because this is World of Tanks console. Where auto lock is boss. <sighs> so we're getting capped. 
So I gotta try to get back there and see if I can reset it. And this tank can definitely get back there, that's for sure. Sometimes you're, you're screwed because you're on a map like this. Someone starts capping and you don't have a fast enough tank to get back. Guess what? That's not this time. Can I shoot anything from up here? Oop, there's a purging. 321 into him. Reset the cap. Keep firing and he decides to come over behind the rock because he knows that, uh... I wish I hadn't got spotted. I didn't think I'd get spotted between with these bushes all in front of me. Like, I'm in a medium tank. I had two bushes in front of me and I still got spotted when I fired. I guess there was a little crack right there. Maybe that's why. Maybe. But there's a bunch of bushes there. I was going to go back and shoot again from the same spot. But then I decided, nah. I can't guarantee that I'm going to sink something there. So, uh... We're going to attack... Full fledge mode, I got full health. Ooh, 1390. Yeah. If he's loaded and everything else, I could be in some serious shit right here. But hopefully I get some team help. I'm looking around because I thought that other tank was still alive, but he's not. That's the one I was looking for because he had the capture points. But he got killed because you know, I'm stupid and didn't realize it. Of course my second shot he sinks into me. Takes out my gunner. But I do put a 309 into him. Get everything repaired. Fuck you, you're not getting away. You're not reloaded, so... You're out of here. 163 finishes him off. Every shot he fired at me penetrated me. Blink, 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 blink. Now I know I'm in this little fast medium. And like I said, it's just a fast light. But you think I'd get at least one mercy bounce? Nope. I'm going to go the wide way, because I was thinking, geez, you know, I want to jump this hill, and nope, not fast enough to do that. I know I'm not going to make it back in time. I know there's no way, so I'm just kind of like tooling around the back country here. I guess I could have gone up the center, but I still wouldn't have got back there in time. It wouldn't have mattered. So I was just, the first thing I was doing was trying to jump that. And then I was like, fuck it, I didn't make it, so I still want to go up the hill. I should have just stopped, I guess. As soon as I didn't make it, I should have stopped. Shop shoot a contract. Victory, V for victory. 55,790 silver. 3,646 XP the multiplier. 2,000 damage. No block, no assist. Only 1,100 XP base XP, but we are at the top of the list in the tier 9 game, so, one shot for 340 into the, uh, Udez 16, T49, I got 9 XP and 933 silver, because he killed himself, object 704, one shot for 278, auto lock, M103, one shot for 353, I believe that was an auto lock, Pershing, one shot for 321. I aimed that one. T30, one shot for 313. I'm pretty sure that was an auto lock because the aimed one didn't go. And then AMX 1390, two shots for 469. 999. Nine. Took him out of the game. So I only had one kill. It was, it was pretty much a blah game, really. But I ended up at the top of the list. And with the games I had that night, guess what? That's a good game. <laughs> because some nights you just... I can't do shit. 12 shots fired, 11 hits, 7 penetrations. 2,074 damage dealt. Damage, 6 tanks, took out only 1. Received 900 in damage, so I was getting close to getting destroyed. But, you know something? Mr. AMX 1390... Suck my balls, Mr. AMX 1390. Suck him. Deep. Suck him. Hope you enjoyed the video. Comment, rate, subscribe. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Tell me what I did right or wrong. And remember, when you're on that battlefield, shoot the red ones.